Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, let's quickly learn how you can just lock and unlock your SIM card by using your Android device. Now, if you want to protect your SIM card from unwanted people, well, if you lock your SIM card, then no one will be able to get an access to your device unless they know the password of your SIM card. With the SIM card, we do too many work that is related to our bank. We also use SIM card to set the two-factor authentication for applications like for Facebook, Instagram, and more. Now, either if you want to know how to lock it and unlock Lock your SIM card on an Android device. Keep on watching this video to learn how you can do that. Now, if you want to lock your SIM card on your Android device, first work that you want to do is just go ahead and open up your settings. And right after that, you can simply search for SIM lock. Then we can tap on search and type SIM lock. Now here, you'll be able to see the option called SIM card lock available on your device. Now just go ahead and tap on there, and now you'll be able to see this option. Tap on SIM card lock. Now here, you need to enable this option. Just go ahead and tap on here, and now this is going to ask you for entering the passcode or the PIN for your SIM card. Now you can ask, where am I going to get the SIM PIN? Well, by default, your SIM PIN might be 1234 or for zero. I mean, you can enter zero, 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 or you can get the code just right from your SIM information. Well, if you get this a plastic or a SIM holder just like this, now here as you guys can see, first it's giving you the pin one where you'll be able to get the pin code. Here it says four zero, so I'll just go ahead and tap zero, 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 and then tap OK. And then you'll be able to see now your SIM lock is activated. Now the best thing is you can change your SIM pin as well. Because by default pin, everybody knows that. Now if you tap change SIM pin here first, you need to enter the old pin first. And right after that, you need to choose a four digit pin for your SIM card. Now you can choose anything you want. And now retype your pin again, tap OK. Now your SIM is locked. Well now let's go ahead and restart our device just to check whether the SIM got locked or not. Alright guys, so as you guys can see, as soon as I turn on my phone, here this is asking enter your SIM pin. Now just go ahead and enter your SIM pin here, and now your phone is gonna be unlocked. Now here is what you need to know. If you keep entering the wrong pin code for your SIM card more than 3 to 10 times, then your SIM card is gonna be locked. So keep that in mind and use this pin code safely with your Android device. Now let's talk about how you can turn off or how you can unlock your SIM pin on your Android device. Now let's pretend that we forgot our password of our SIM pin. Now the question is how do I open my phone and how do I even unlock the SIM card? Now first, please do not enter wrong pin too many times because if you do that your sim card will get pock locked so the first thing that you guys can do you can literally use the last password that you can remember that you had set it for your sim card let's say you enter the last pin code but it's still you're unable to unlock your sim card in that case we try to recommend you to use the default pin which can be one two three four or you can use four zero to unlock your sim card since we remember our pin so i'm just going to go ahead and enter it to unlock it well, now if you want to just permanently turn off the settings or turn up the pin for your SIM card, you got to go to the same spot and then toggle this up. Now, if this asks you for the password or pin, go ahead and enter the same pin that you use to unlock your SIM card to just unlock your SIM card permanently. So this is how you guys can lock and unlock your SIM card on your Android device and this is how you can do it. I hope you found this video useful. If so, drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you later.